Good morning, Kids Church. We have got an amazing service for you this morning. We've got worship in a bit. We've got an amazing word from Victoria. And also we've got Sydney coming back. So before we get started, we're just going to pray for all those boys and girls out there who are going back to school tomorrow. I hope you're excited. So dear Lord Jesus, we thank you for who you are, Lord. We thank you for all these boys and girls out there who are going back to school tomorrow. They're gonna to see all their friends again. And we just pray for peace over them. We pray that no one here would be anxious. We just love you, Father. We know that you love these kids and they're gonna have an amazing day tomorrow. In Jesus' name, amen. Oh, 
When you seek, he's there. When you knock, 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 God opens up the door. When you ask, he cares. When you seek, he's there. When you knock, 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 God opens up the door. Kiss Church, it's so good to see you again. Hope you had a really, really nice week. So today I got a new word for you, and that word is ambassador. But what is it, an ambassador? An ambassador is someone chosen by the king, queen, or country to represent them in a foreign land. It would be like if I was chosen to represent Spain in England. Paul writes in 2 Corinthians 5:20. We are therefore Christ's ambassadors, as though God were making his appeal through us. We implore you on Christ's behalf, be reconciled to God. What an amazing honour is to be an ambassador for Christ. However, we can't do it by ourselves. We need to stay very, very close to God in, in order to be able to represent him. It's like, you can't really represent a king if you don't know him. Well, it's the same with God. We can't really represent him well if we don't know him. So Kids Church, let's take a moment this week to read or know more about God's qualities so you can be an amazing ambassador for Christ. Have an amazing week Kids Church. See you soon. Bye. Kids Church! Did you hear the one about the pizza dough? No. Don't worry, don't worry, it's pretty cheesy. Hey! <laughs> Hi Kids Church, me and Josh are going to do a race but we're going to have to keep a balloon inside of our legs. If we drop the balloon we have to go back to the start, first one to the end of the line wins. No! <laughs> Well, good day, chickadees. I'm Sydney the Explorer, and I'm here to explore nature with you. Well, good morning, my little chickadees. I'm excited to see you. I've come on a nature walk, and you'll never guess what I've found. Found myself a stream. That's right, and what better thing to do with an amazing bridge like this over a stream than to build a stick raft? Got all my bits and pieces here. Basically, I went out and got myself a handful of quite dry, dead, you don't really want to pull them off the tree, do you know what I mean? Got myself some dead sticks and twigs off the floor, got a, quite a few like that. Also, got some big leaves, these ones are ivy leaves, I got these big leaves for the sales, I'm excited about that part. Also, picked myself up some daffodil grass, because it's long, it's strong, it'll be good for binding it up, and there's loads of daffodils around at the moment. So. Let's get started. What we're going to do is we're going to take like a small handful of the sticks, yeah? And we're going to tie it up using a leaf like this. Put it on one end like that. Going to bind it up. That's it. Nice and tight. If you can. They're quite fiddly. But just give it a go. Try and get lots. Don't tell anyone you're taking all the daffodil leaves. It's fine. There's plenty of them around. There you go, so I've got my two, got my two. But it's a bit chilly still, so I'm gonna get up, I'm gonna move around, because I've lost feeling in my, in my legs, you know what I mean? I'm gonna give it a little bit of this, get that blood flowing back in, Whew, get that leg going. So we're gonna get our mast. The mast is what we're gonna hang the sail onto. Now I'm gonna put it between them like this. Now you might need a buddy or someone to help you with this next bit, because we're gonna bind them up again. I might use one of these bad boys, I'm just gonna take one of these. Don't tell anyone yet, I'm just gonna take it. 
I've not used one of these leaves before, so it might not work. I'm going to give it a whirl. Just find what you can. That's what nature's all about. It's about getting out there and finding stuff, isn't it? Oh, yeah, no, this is working really well. Look, this is really... Cro oh, look at that. Whoa, now you're talking like... I don't know why I didn't use this one before. There we go. Look at that. Oh, that's a boat now, mate. That's a real boat. Look at that. That right there is a stick raft, and I'm excited. But now what we've got to do is we've got to give it a little sail up here on the top. So I've got myself a big ivy leaf. I'm just going to stick it in the top like this. Oh, look at that, Kids Church. That's a raft right there. Shall we go and see if it'll float? Let's do it. Oh, Kids Church, this is the moment of truth. Is it going to float? Who knows? So what I'm going to do is I'm going to drop it on the side of the stream that's sending the current the other way. And it's going to go under the bridge and we're going to follow it. Are you ready? I'm excited. Here we go. Ready? There she goes. She's floating. Oh, she's a right beaut, that one. Look at her go. Oh, look, she's hit the rapids. Wow, she's really going through the white water now. Look at that. Wow, she's handling that really well. Look at that. Wow. And off she goes, off into her adventures into the night or the day. Well, I must say, that was a humongous success, chickadees. Now, you can have a go at this. Just get yourself outside, get into nature, and have fun. See you soon, kids, Church. Bye. Well, wasn't that a great Kids Church service? We so enjoyed spending time with you in your homes and our leaders in their homes. If you want to get involved, you want to send something in for Kids Church at home, or you want to know some more information about our Zoom parties, you can contact us at kids at newlifechurch.me. We love you, we miss you, we can't wait to see you again soon. Bye! Kids Church!